Hey there, all craft beer lovers. Time for that beer review. So, we are returning to Denmark for this time around, guys. We are going back to Gamma Brewing Company. Taking a look at this fella. Low Slung Triple IPA. Coming in at 10% ABV. 440ml can. There you go. Uh, contains uh, water, barley, wheat and oats. Hops and yeast. Hop to mosaic, nectaron and uh, ruwaka. There you go. 10%er triple IPA. The uh, usual kind of uh, modernistic uh, artwork from Gamma. Let's pop it, see what we get. So, Gamma Brewing Company, guys. There we go. Yeah, filled to the very brim. That we like. So, yeah, Gamma Brewing Company. I haven't had a beer from these guys in a while. Uh, they are doing some really good IPAs for sure. There we go. For sure. Good solid IPAs and double IPAs. And I think that's basically... Uh, yeah, I, I don't know if I've ever encountered a stout or anything from these guys. Yo, uh, yeah, I have. I have. Uh, when it come, uh, here it comes. So I believed I did a, uh, I reviewed a uh, stout from these guys a year ago, one and a half year ago. I don't know, but it was a very very lovely coconut stout. I believe. Don't remember the name of it, but yeah, they did uh, a stout. But they're mostly known for their IPAs and double IPAs. There we go, guys. What do we have? Two and a half fingers worth. I would say it of a nice white head. Uh, small bubbles on top looks like rich and creamy foam uh, looks like mango juice basically in the glass there we go aroma yeah and that's what you get on the nose as well kind of a lovely rich mangoey vibe a slight earthiness to it as well yeah, definitely kind of an earthy tone to it. But yeah, mango, tropical uh, notes, earthiness. Yeah. So with that said, let's get this one and this show on the road. Cheers all. So, okay, so it's very chalky. Right off the bat, it's very chalky. It's a chalky beer. Uh, and it's surprisingly kind of devoid of flavors, to be honest. I mean, I got an initial kind of unspecified tropical vibe, but then it kind of just fades out and you're left with just a bit of chalkiness, I guess. Uh, weird again. <sighs> and that's really, really weird. Really weird to tell you the truth. It's really strange because, yeah, I get an initial sweet tropical vibe really hard to pinpoint perhaps a little bit of mango but that's f as far as it gets basically and then you're just right right about getting into that chalkiness basically and all the flavors are just vanishing very 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 quickly and you're left with a lot of chalkiness and a lot of carbonation okay so the beer is out uh, let's go for a final sip, guys, on this one. Mm. <sighs> okay, so when I got now, when I got the back end pour in, I do get a little bit of a hop burny sensation, but still that chalkiness, it's still there. 
Uh, so for me, guys, uh, Gamma Brewing Company and their Low Slung Triple IPA coming at 10%. I would say right off the bat, the alcohol is very well concealed. Uh, however, the uh, the flavors are kind of so-so, to be honest. Uh, slight initial sweet uh, tropical vibe, unspecified tropical fruits, and then it kind of just disappears and you're left with a chalky and hop burny taste. For me, not one of the best triple IPAs I've ever had, but I mean, it's still drinkable. Alcohol is very well concealed, dangerously concealed. I would say it's just a little bit of danger bear because it drinks like a 5 percenter and it's still 10%. So it's quite dangerous there to drink cars. But for me, uh, 3.25 out of 5. Thank you for watching.